I really appreciated um, with KCC just that we opened. And I know that seems so cliche, but I was so glad that we opened and we gave our kids just a chance for a little bit of normalcy. I mean, besides the masks and all the protocols and safety procedures and trying to stay six feet apart, really what happened inside the building each and every day was pretty much the way it was supposed to happen. It's the way it happens most every school year. One of the things that KCC does so well is to hire teachers who are not just great teachers, but that genuinely love their students and, and want to be able to see the Lord use them in the classroom and pour into their students. You know, one of the greatest challenges that we've dealt with in the band uh, this year, in, in all of our bands, has been uh, managing rehearsal. Uh, between finding rehearsal time and good rehearsal space, uh, it's, it's been a, a daily uh, daily challenge. One of the hardest things about this last calendar year was just the loss of relational opportunities that we had. Quarantine, obviously with everyone being isolated, made it so difficult. Trying to teach from home, that transition. Although I feel like we handled it as best as we possibly could, it was still so difficult for everyone. It's been really hard wearing a mask. It gets kind of stuffy, but we're all safe, so that's good. What's been tough about COVID is some of my friends have gotten sick and they haven't been able to show up to school. So I'd say the hardest part about this year was definitely wearing the mask, but it's not for the reason that you think. Um, it is really hard, especially being somebody who loves facial expressions, um, to show preschoolers how excited you are about the milestones that they're making and the achievements that they have when they can barely see you know, any of your face. Something I found difficult about COVID was that with senior year that you kind of just think about all of high school, middle school, like the senior year feeling and being in pep club and like seeing your classmates like complete their senior year and not having live sports events has been really difficult. You know, I think the hardest thing with COVID has just been all of the different protocols and um, aspects we've had to change of our sports program. What did I miss the most about this school year? Um, having parents in the building, having the community events. Um, that's what makes KCC special, in my opinion. I, I'm worshiping together in chapel, you know, all the events that we have like Watermelon Welcome and packing out the gymnasium for basketball games, all, all of those things. Uh, not being able to have parents, you know, in the building, at events, on campus, um, that was unusual, um, that was difficult. It's been tough that the theater has been shut down quite a bit. But I will say that teaching aspect of being in person has been a life changer. Doing it last year, the last quarter, without being in person was so difficult. It's just, it's so much easier to convey an idea, a subject, when you're actually with the kid. And that's been a massive blessing. If anything was challenging, it was that. It was that lot, loss of personal interaction and daily getting to see people uh, that you cared about and students that you really cared about and, and wanted to be able to spend time with and, and pour your life into. So I think that uh, I, I've learned a lot this year. Um, God says to consider pure joy when we experience trials of many kinds. Well, this, this certainly was a trial. And um, I probably learned a lot of things, but I think what stands out the most for me is what I relearned. And, and that is essentially um, when Christian parents and Christian educators get together and they decide that they want to make Christian education happen for kids, then God's going to bless that. Uh, I'm really excited to watch our spring sports play. Um, you know, a lot of these kids, uh, it's been our seniors, the last time they stepped on the floor or on the field or anywhere as in their spring sport, they were sophomores. We have a lot of kids that the spring sport is their main sport. So I think for me, the biggest blessing is letting the kids get back into that. The, the great thing to come out of all of that is that we have been able to continue rehearsing. Uh, you know, I talk to a lot of my friends and colleagues that teach at the public school level, and they're, they're not able, uh, at least at the start of the year, they were not able to have rehearsal. They were doing everything virtual, uh, including band. And I'm, I'm so thankful that that is uh, nothing that, that we had to attempt to tackle here. But even through all the trials of it, God has really given us this community that we can be together and grow from each other. And just that we can love on your kids still, even though we can't, you know, give them the hugs and the things that we would normally want to. Just getting to be together has been so precious. You know, from a leadership position, you're here to serve. I mean, Jesus was the greatest leader and he showed us how to do it 
by serving others. And I just think still being able to come to KCC and to serve the families and to serve the community and the students just really showed me that um, God has his hand on KCC.